Hey, what's up everyone? It's Simon Chan. I'm here to fire you up and get you going because we all know we need some motivation like the way we need oxygen. Today, we're going to take a quote from the Motivational Quote Book. Hey, if you need some motivation, here's a free copy for you. It's a collection of quotes that I've collected from over 600 guests I've had on my podcast and they each share what motivates them and I put together in a little book for you. Hey, it's free. Just drop in book in the comments, tag someone and I'll send you a link where you can download it. All right. So good to see everyone here. It is Wednesday midweek. Hope you're all having a um, good week so far. Hey, let's do a little checkup right now. How has your week been? <clears throat> right? You know, we work on a cycle. I, I, I sound like a uh, dead horse repeating myself. That's the wrong saying, beating a dead horse, right? But we talking about this over and over again. You plan out your weeks, plan out your prospects, plan out the volume targets, and then you're going to get there. You're going to be more productive every week. And you work on the weekly cycle. Okay. Uh, so what do we do is, how has your week been on a scale of 1 to 10? Look at your back. Go back to the, how you plan out your week. And if you haven't planned out your week, hey, never too late. You can get started next week. Um, and even today, just set it by Friday. What's the target I want to hit? Right? A lot of times we have income goals, but what are some targets where we need to hit? So I think for me, yesterday was a super productive day. A little break there, no baseball for the kids. I mean, I did some one on one time, but there's no practice. Uh, got a lot of stuff done, bearing down, and I'm grateful. And I share one thing I, I've been talking about this the last two weeks that's been very helpful. Every night before I go to bed, I always plan out, right? That one big thing that I have to do, the one priority thing. And that is has helped me get a lot, lot more done. So, Cello, great to see you. Got a nine. Lena, my friend, good to see you. Uh, Crystal, good to see that you're on track with an eight. Um, and by the way, if you're watching live on Instagram right now, DM me and I'll send you the book. Book, okay? If you're watching on the replay, you can just drop book in the comments and tag someone. I'll send this link for you to download. Um, yes. Eric, planning is the key. Not just planning, but the top priority, one thing. So, of course, we have unlimited things we need to do. Unlimited prospects we got to follow up, right? Social media, we stuff we have to do. Things we got to learn. But just choosing one thing has been a game changer for me. So even if I don't do anything else, but the one thing I focus on. And generally, the one thing is like the hard thing to do, right? It's the thing that's cumbersome, takes time. But just I'll tell you, that's been a game, big game changer Focusing on that one thing. All right, today's quote. I'm gonna wish you know this is from my late mentor. Had a big, uh, big help for me was uh, my late mentor Jim Rohn. It just says, you know, when I first started, I wish things were easier. I wish like, why is the business so hard? Why is making sales so difficult? I just wish it was easier. How many of you had you wish like that? Drop in the two in the comments. I wish it was easier. Why does it have to be so hard? I shared two things that uh, was a big game changer for me. That shifted the way I looked at things. Okay. I shifted. I just turned my head backwards here. Forward. Shifted the way I looked at things. So number one was this quote from Jim Rohn. It says, don't, don't wish it was easier. Wish you were better. Okay. It's like, ouch. Don't wish it was easier. Wish you were better. Right? So instead of focusing on oh, complaining, ah, oh, it's too hard, wait, focus on yourself and then, hey, how can I get better? How can I get better? Wish you were better. What do you need to focus on? And we're talking about focus on one thing at a time. So it could be like, hey, I'm not getting presentations. So maybe work on your social media. Be that person. Carl, Carl Sullivan, great to see you. Be that person. Right? Carl got like, hey, by the way, three signups last week staying focused, right? B, what's that one thing I need to get better on? That's what you focus on, right? Don't wish it was easy, wish you were better. Second thing I want to share with you that made a big impact on me, mindset shift, was you want it hard. Did I just say that? Yeah, you want it difficult. Because, you, you know, if you want it difficult, why? It's because that's where, when you make it, you get the big bucks. When you get better, you make the big money. You want to wish it easier, hey, go on welfare, go on government benefits. It's easy. doesn't get paid much. You look at things in life. I'm teaching my boys this. You want to do it hard. The easy jobs, you don't make much money. There's no, there's no reward to that. The hard stuff is when the reward is. The, not just the money-wise, the fulfillment you've done something. Right? Taking a breath of fresh air, oxygen. That was easy. I got paid no money for that. Do what's hard. And you get paid good, you get good, good, good rewards. So you don't want to wish it easier, you know. Embrace that it's hard and wish focus on getting better. Hey, that's my message for you. Go look about your process right now. Number one, don't complain about it. Hey, hey, embrace that it's hard 
And number two is, look at in, in your process, in your daily life, your business life, or in your personal life, what part of your life needs to get better, right? And focus on that one part. Anyway, that's my message. Go make it happen. Go make, uh, and by the way, the free book, for those who don't have it, drop a book in the comments. I'll send it out to you. You're watching live on Instagram. DM me right after this. I'll send it out to you. And go out there, get better, stay focused, and have a positive impact on someone's life today. God bless. I'll see you back tomorrow.